Hey yo, welcome back to my channel. I am She Bang Beat. Thank you for stopping by. And if you're new to the channel, welcome. I know you're hitting that subscribe button right now. Da ding 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 ding. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that like button. It really helps the channel grow. And we're growing and glowing together. So make sure you do that. Make sure you follow all of my social medias. And today, oh, but today we're going to be making, I don't know what we're going to be making, but I do have a loop. And so I'm just going to say it's going to be something hard and it's going to be something fun. I'm going to walk you through how I created the loop and everything that I added on the loop and all of that good stuff, each instrument, all of that good stuff that you want to see. I'm actually going to make the drums on camera so you all can see the drum process at least. So let's get into the video. Okay, so we're in Logic. We're about to get these drums. Well, I'm gonna walk you through the loop first, all of the instruments that I used. And then we're gonna get to those drums. So let's get started. Let me get my screen record going. First instrument we have is this. It's a guitar. I'm in G minor. It's actually a very simple progression. Added some tape delay to it, some guitar stomp, some retro, I mean some RC20, vinyl three, turned the wobble up a little bit, and then my channel EQ. I cut off some of the lows. We also have this finisher micro, I added the lead delay, turned it, uh, turned it up, turned the effect up a little bit. And that's a free plugin, by the way. And then I added some, then I added some S1 Imager on here to spread it out a little bit. And then here, it's just like some, I think it's Beauty Piano in Nexus. And on there, I added some channel EQ, cut those lows out some more uh, micro or finisher micro, turned the amount of the effect down a little bit on the jet plane preset. Then I added some effect tricks, a little vinyl, a little stutter, a little delay and some reverb. Then I added some delay. I'm gonna let you hear it without the delay. That, that delay is a, this is a preset, is a filter murky and all i did was it not all i did it added like that little a little bounciness to it and then i added a compressor on here opto squeeze preset and then next i have some strings nothing too fancy eq'd out the bottom end and i threw some s1 imager on it and tilted the sound a little bit as you can see right here and it's just nothing but the same chords. It's just chords. Here we have some piano. This is the original piano because I did put halftime on it. That's the original piano. And then I threw the halftime on it. And of course, EQ'd out the low end. Then we have... This is some chords I got out of Arcade, out of Memento, Never Ending Chords. And then here, I just have a vocal sound. And on there, what I did was I, when I added the vocal sound, I added some reverb and some effect tricks on there as you can hear but then i bounced it out and i just added the fades at the end so you can fade off at the ends and in the beginning so it can fade in and fade out and you can still hear that delay at the end of each phrase so that's basically the whole not basically but that's the whole loop right there we're going to add some drums on here and get it popping matter of fact we might have to use both of those <laughs> Copy that over. Uh oh, no, we're gonna take that. We're gonna convert to MIDI. 
and we're going to take these take this roll and change the velocity all right all right and also i want to change the pan too we're going to change that pan like that another hi-hat and get to it and yes I am going to change the velocities of the hi-hat to give it more movement and sound better And I'm gonna add some um, some pancake to it, free plug-in. And I am going to add a preset on here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. <laughs> velocity and for one we uh oh we're going to right click no we're going to go to function go to midi transform and then we're going to go to random velocity i want my velocity to be 127 to 69 do that hit select and operate and then we're going to go <laughs> Matter of fact, we're gonna have that come in like that. And we're gonna do this on the same thing. And then we're gonna add some Effectrix to that, of course. 
change the pitch of some of the hi-hats. Change those hi-hats. Well, that's pretty much the end of the beat. I'm probably just going to add like some effects and transitions and things like that. And I'm going to let you hear the beat now. the channel tremendously uh -huh. and we're friends and I know that you all are following all of my social medias make sure you let me know that you're from YouTube and I'll definitely hit the follow back um so yeah this is the end of the video sorry guys it all has to come to an end one day so she bangs